Hollins Thomas Stone FightHype.com here with Hank Lundy. How you feeling, man? Oh, I'm good, man. It's the game, man. For sure, but um, you know, you you said that you're gonna retire a, a few times now. <laughs> <laughs> they keep calling me back in. <laughs> exactly. So, you know, is, is this something that's actually serious, or is it just like eh, I took a loss? You know, just kind of spur the moment kind of thing, man. No, you know, I'm gonna be real, man. 17 years in the game. I ran and ducked from nobody. I fought the best. I fought who they put in front of me. You know what I mean? So there's no more to prove. What can you say that Hank Lundy didn't do? I've been all over the country fighting. You know what I mean? You know, it's time to hang them up, man. Time to hang them up, man. For sure. Um, just like in your honest opinion, because I know when you're in the ring with Kurt, it's right. like, you know, it's a lot of emotions and he's right there. Right. But do you think he has what it takes to beat some of those top guys at 140, like a Teal Fimo? Like, like I, 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 I was telling him, you know, at the end of the day, he's a strong kid, but at the end of the day, you gotta learn how to be patient, you know what I mean? Like, you know, if I was a little bit more stronger, like like I told him, I told him right now, he was a strong, he's a strong kid, but he, 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 he gonna get it as he go and he train, he's gonna work on certain things. But you know what I mean, like I told him, got you my guy. Once he work on a couple more things, he, he gonna be good. He, he, he definitely gonna be good, you know what I mean? Just. It's just like experience level. You know, I'm a smaller guy. If I was a little bit more stronger, then I could have got yeah. through it. You know what I mean? But like I said, as he get up in his career, he'll, he'll not adjust to certain things in that ring. Gotcha, man. What's the last thing on your career? What would you say is your best win and proudest moment in there? I'm not going to lie. David Diaz. I fought David Diaz with a broken rib. Mm. Um, about two weeks before the fight, I fell on the steps. And you can see. <laughs> My ribs still stick out. I fought him with a broken rib, and I end up knocking him out cold. Gotcha. Look, man, congratulations on the great career. Maybe we'll still see you again. We don't nah, know. No, but... no, nah, it's done and over with, man. It's done and over, man. I'm gone. Gotcha. I, I appreciate listening. I thank boxing for saving my life, you know what I mean, giving me the limelight. Bought me so many things. I had my business and this, everything off, and I'm successful. Sure. But, you know. My heart and love goes out to boxing. Thank you for saving my life. You know what I mean? Gotcha. Thank you, brother. It's always been great, man. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, man.